Hi, this is Lisa. And Yolanda. I want to say hi to everybody. We've been going for a while. Wave, Yolanda. Let's see your hey. hand. Okay. Um, we did, we had a request from um Linda Lab, Tammy Dawn A, and Froggy Rules 1966 on how we put our um our um hand bound books together. Okay. I'm trying to keep this video short. I won't talk. I mean, I will talk, but well, you know what I mean. Anyway, um. We use pack product packaging, of course. This is a Mike and Mike box. We guess of it, um, unless we're going to leave it like it is, like this one. But um, we guess of it, and on the inside, I reinforce it with crap paper, with crap um, cardstock, to you know, to make the make it more sturdy. And when you apply the cardstock, it's best to use the PVA. Oh yeah, I use PVA, so I didn't add that. Um, normally, I use book binding thread, which I wax because I don't have the wax thread, but. Um, and that's, I use one of these two awls here to make the holes for the book and in the, um, in the spine for the book. Um, beads, if you want to put beads on the cover, it's beads. And I'm not going to put beads on this one because it's going to take too long. But, but you guys, you can look at the Mike and Ike minis and you know what I mean. Okay. Uh, I'm using yarn for this so everybody can, so you can see it easier as I, th as I sew it. I have two signatures, which is a group of papers folded together, whatever pages you want. You, you, you put them together however you want to put them. And, um, and I have my cover here, which I painted. I guess it, and then I paint it. There we go. Okay, I'm going to start by, and I hope I didn't leave anything out. <laughs> Trying to make it quick, guys, because nobody wants to sit through a terribly long video. Okay, here's my. I have a, a large um, a needle with a large hole in it here for this yarn. And what I do is I decide which one I'm going to want for, for the um, first signature. And I have four holes punched in here. In here, and I hold it together with a um with a clip so that they won't move while I'm working. And I I go through the first hole here. And out, put it there. I'm trying to stay in front of the camera, and I get my um, oops. And make sure your covers turn the right way. <laughs> Most important. Yeah, because I believe me, I made a mistake before. And oh, make sure your papers turn the right way. Okay. And I went through the first hole, and then I went out, and I'm going into the first hole here in the cover. Go through, pull it through. And you pull through the cover, then you go ah, pull in and make sure you hold this thread so it won't. And normally I clip it so it won't move, so I don't have to keep babysitting it. I clip it onto here so it won't go through the hole, and then you have to start all over again. Clip it here, yeah, to hold it steady for me. Okay, and you'll definitely want the pages clipped before you start sewing because otherwise they slide, they all, slide over all over the place, and you have and, and you mess up your pages. But I pulled it through. There, not too much. Okay, and then I go back out. See where I came out here, and then I go back in the second hole here, and then go in the second hole in the signatures. That's gonna be difficult. Nope. Oh, there we go. I'm trying to hold it up so you can see it, and I have to put it down for one second, guys, because it is a lot to get through and pull the yarn too. Come on, give it go. Because normally we don't use Yeah, normally we don't use it. <laughs> <yarn. laughs> this will be done if I have yarn. <laughs> there you go, and you pull it through. As you can see, it's there on the cover. That's one part. And then here's where you, you before you go into that second hole, if you want to put beads, here's where you put your beads before you go into this hole. Okay, then you're inside the book. Pull it through. You go back out the center hole. Now you can put as many holes in as you want, and as many um, strings of beads as you, as you want on your on your book. You go back out here. Let me hold it up so you can see. Go back out here, and back through this hole here. I hope you guys can see that. <laughs> this is all for nothing. <laughs> okay, and you pull it back out through here. Okay. 
there we go. I see it's in the center here. Yeah. And then here is where is your opportunity to put your beads again. Like here. Oops, like here. Like here. There's two sets of beads here. Here's your opportunity. You can't put them in there because we can put them on the first one. Ah, uh, okay. You can't because okay, um, I see here, I have two sections. These are closer together than the one I'm working on. Here's your opportunity to put your beads on. Okay, it's right here. You put them on here, and then you go back into the bottom hole, and this is the last one for the signature, and you take it, oops, I'm going through the bottom hole, and take it through, back through the bottom hole in the signature, and uh, this is going to be hard to do. This is so hard with yarn. Okay. Did you get it in? Yeah. Or do you need me to pull it up? Oh, this is hard. Okay, and you pull it back through. And like I said, normally working with thread is much easier. Or floss. Yeah, or floss. And what you can do is, you can take the clip off of here. Take a clip off the bottom. You can cut your thread here. Uh, no, let's not cut it yet. You can pull you can pull the needle off. And there you go. And you can tie it here. Now you can. There are several different ways to do this. This way is easier for me. To, um, and then you can tie it here. Yes, it looks like a lot going on but of course I'm using yarn and that's why it looks that way and you tie it here well you can go through here and tie it through that little center piece right here tie it here tie it off there you have to make several knots so it won't slip and sometimes I put a tiny bit of glue on the knot so it won't come so it won't come through the um and pull it tight there you go but you have to tie that knot several times okay see how the um, signature is in there and I will be testing the second signature, but... <laughs> <laughs> but this yard is going to be tough. Yeah, but I wanted to show you guys how it's done. There you are. Okay, if you have any questions, let me know. I'll do another one. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks everybody for watching. Thanks. Bye. Bye.